happy Mother's Day. It goes on and on and on. Alright guys, so we're here today at uh, DCA. DCA, yay! <laughs> uh, we're here to come check out some more of the Pixar Fest goodies. And, yeah, um, today's the first day of the booths, the Pixar booths, so that's something I'm we'll not even out. know, I don't even know the formal name of it, but... Uh, the Taste of Pixar Fest. The Taste of Pixar Fest. Uh, and uh. quite honestly, I didn't take a look at a sneak peek of what they have to offer yeah. what kind of food so it's all going to be a surprise for it's us it's going to be so a surprise so why don't you guys come along and be surprised with us yeah come along join us yeah oh i guess i gotta get my camera on oh Look who's out. keeping the streets of carthay safe as always thank you for keeping okay. us safe welcome buddy <laughs> you wear your adorable hat today Yes. Who's <laughs> working? My cup holder's happy. Oh, my tank is full. You my engine's running like a brummer bull. <laughs> my bumpers are polished and talks about luck. I just got a date with an ice cream truck. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys know there's a magic band activation point right here. And you make it sing. Did Make it sing. Down? Here, let's do another one. Okay. Did it vibrate? Yeah. Wait, did he oh. just say we couldn't have dessert? All right, let's go. They said <laughs> so no dessert. Cool. No dessert. Dang it. But first, let's go check out okay. and see what the carts have. Yes. Oh, yeah. They got some uh, they got some things up over there. I'm going to go check it out. Yeah, let's go check it out. <laughs> there are the things right over there. You see them? The boots. Oh, I'm hungry already. Me too. Let's see. So we're not sure exactly if um, we buy a card or is it just like you go up and pay for it and buy it. But it looks like they have a little information cart thing right over here. Yeah. Right there. So uh, it looks like these, they're not going to actually have like a card like you would a food and wine festival. It's mostly going to be you just come up and you pay for it. And then uh, they give you your your servings. So yeah. um, not like the food and wine festival no. where there's like a scan card or anything. Yeah, that's cool though. They, I mean, it looks pretty cool. Like this first one, elemental table. table. Yeah, let's see what they have. Yeah, that's, sorry. <laughs> let's go see what they have. <laughs> so here at elemental table, smoked firewood. This looks good. Cool nut whoopie cookie pie. Yeah. H2O Rita and an exothermic margarita. Ooh, Ooh, I want to try that. Let's go check out Spider Man. Yeah, let's go check out Spider Man. Here we go. I'll be right there. So over here at uh, close to the Wine Country Trattoria, they have the four, time, four town favorites. Ooh. What do they got here? Uh, looks like they got, what is that? Red Pando Bao? Oh, a red Pando oh, Bao. Oh, chili garlic salt. That looks pretty good. And Sounds got kind the of spicy. And the Apocalypse. Ooh. And then. Nobody like you cooler, non-alcoholic. Looks pretty good. What do you think you want to try from this one? I don't know. I, the bow sounds good, but I'm afraid that it might be spicy. I'll try the bow. But we could try it and yeah. see. Yeah. All right. So it looks like they have a QR code here. And that'll give you access to the menu. Oh, what do they have paper. here? What do we have here? Uh huh. What is that? So it looks like a little, um, like a menu and where to find all the goodies. You can scan Ooh. that QR code, basically, give you the same. If you want to scan it, you 
can scan it now. Yeah. Is there anything on the back side of that? I wonder? Let's see. Oh, oh yeah. there is more. And uh, wait, there's more. Wait, there's more. There you go. All right, let's go check All it right, out. All right, let's go see. So one thing that we've learned is there is no tasting cards for uh, the Pixar Fest foods, the, you know, the food booths. So it's pretty much you go up to the booth, you order your food and you pay for it. Yeah. Um, there's no tasting cards or... Um, not those, like the food and wine festival. No, not thing. like the food and wine no. festival, but... Um, but that's okay because it gives you an opportunity to have other things around the park. Yeah. You know? And word of advice is if there's something you want, you better go get it because I have a feeling those lines are going to get pretty long. Yeah. So, I don't know. Well, I'm, we'll see how popular it is. I, I wonder guess. if you can order multiple. <laughs> oh, at one location? One location. And then just so. pick it up. We'll try. Let's go we'll try. try. We'll We're try. We're going to give it a try and see. Yeah. And then we'll let you know. Yeah. <laughs> Spark. Does that have? No. Spark. You got super club chicken and potato waffles. Oh, that sounds this good. This one kind of looks good. Half nut jazz cake. What is that? Oh. The great beyond gin, maracino, liqueur, violet, and blue curacao syrups, lemon juice, and pear nectar. Huh. Uh, topped with butterfly pea flower tea and garnished with a white orchid. And they also have your non-alcoholic sparkler. Oh yeah. Cotton candy, blue food cow, mango puree, and pineapple and lime juice. So that's pretty good. And then you can get your flights here also. You got some uh, looks like some IPA flights, seltzer flights, pale ale, and some Heffenweiser. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> A little tasting eating area. Were these up last last time we were here? Uh, I wasn't sure. Those wasn't, tasting areas were tables, tasting, tasting tables, tables were up last time we tasting came. Tasting tables. <laughs> um, but uh, I don't recall. But pretty cool. If they weren't, they are now. So. All else fails. There's always a trash can. Yeah. You know. Good old trash can. Trash. Trash. <laughs> you can always use a trash can. <laughs> oh, we got one more. Oh, Portoroso pasta. pasta. Ooh. What do we got here? Portoroso pasta, pesto pasta, ribbon pasta tossed in basil pesto with potatoes and green beans. Mm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Sea monster, sea monster lemonade. lemonade. It's a non alcoholic lemonade, white grape juice, peach syrup. Garnished with blue curacao and mango jelly. Oh, I like that word. Curacao, curacao, curacao. Silencio limoncello. Oh, I bet that's good. I like limoncello. So limoncello amaretto, some Aperol liqueurs, blood orange syrup, lemonade, mm. and house-made oregano tea. Oh. Interesting. Garnished with micro daisy. Sounds interesting. I'm going to try that uh, one. Yeah. The one with oregano tea. Have you ever oregano. had oregano tea before? I've oregano never. tea. I only use oregano for pozole. Sounds spicy. Sounds spicy. Very herby. Yeah. So it looks like 10 30 is when um, these booths are going to open up. Soon. Uh, so pretty soon. We're about 15 minutes TikTok. out. Tick tock. Tick tock. <laughs> I love these trash cans. Like, I love that Disneyland, like, they kind of create like a matching trash can or themed trash can to yeah. the area you're in. I yeah. love that. Oh. Oh. Right above us. That was scary. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's Sully and Mike. Ooh. Oh, cool. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's awesome. That's, that's cool. they, brought out, they brought out the big guns. So yes. <laughs> oh, look at him. He's so awesome. And Mike is so awesome. I love it. Oh my gosh. He's, he's dancing. Look at him. Oh yeah, he is dancing. That's so cool. I love it. That's cool. So this is always a good spot if you guys need to get out of the crowds for a little bit, get into some shade. This area yeah. that's kind of sitting right below the um, symphony the swings, swings uh, is usually mostly 
mostly always empty. And there's benches here. You can grab your favorite snack and just kind of chill and look out. Look out the into the water. And, um, just, let them, you know, just yeah. get away from the crowds if you ever need to get away from the crowds for a bit. <laughs> Give yourself a break. Yeah. <laughs> so we had a wardrobe change. Yay. We got our, our stitch our outfits stitch. on. Stitch. <laughs> now we're Pixar. Now we're Pixar <laughs> and uh, ready for... Uh, I don't know, Hawaii? Hawaii? Let's go to Hawaii. <laughs> Let's go now. Let's go. I'm ready. <laughs> So uh, today's the uh, first day for the Pixar Fest booths to open up. Uh, just a little quick tip. Um, there's no tasting cards. You no. just come to each booth and you pay for your meal and you you go. Yeah. Uh, so no. uh, just so you know, it's not like food and wine festival. Yeah. So Sweet. let's give this a whirl. Looks like we got the um, ratatouille pizette. Pizette. And then we have the smoked fire wood barbecue spiced impossible chicken, which looks like chicken tenders. <laughs> <laughs> it, does. it does. And then we got the uh, whoopee, the koi nut whoopee cookie pie. And then the, um, what is that, a bow? The bow, this one. Oh, the red panda bow. And then to wash it down, we got the... Um, we got this guy here, which is the um, Little Critique Cognac Sidecar, as well as the H2O, H2O Rita. So we got to get grubbing. We got a lot yes. of food to eat. All right, let's eat. Lots of food to eat. All right, so we have the, the Ratatouille Pizza Pizzetta. 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 And this, this was $8. So just just a little um, info. If you there's no tasting cards, but you can order all of the all of the foods items that you're gonna get. You can order them in one booth and then just go and pick them up at each of the booths. Oh. So kind of have an idea what you're gonna order. That way you can do it all at once. Save yourself time from standing in lines and then just go pick up your food items. Good to know. Just a little tidbit. That's kind of like what we did. Yeah. We asked and they said yes. Look at all okay. that mess we got into. I know. <laughs> Must so let's be hungry. Get started <laughs> yeah. With tastings. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and taste this pizza. It looks like it's got some Parmesan, some, looks like some ham. That is a some, big piece of cheese or whatever that is. I think that's, um, what is that called? Ah, brie, brie oh, cheese, brie, brie cheese. Yeah, okay. Looks like brie cheese. So let's go ahead and give it a whirl. I don't know if I want to taste <laughs> the one with the cheese or. Okay, let's just taste. Okay. Mmm. Good stuff. Yeah. That zucchini. I love zucchini. So that zucchini with the pizza, bomb, good, get this. Does it taste like ratatouille? That's what it is, right? Like a ratatouille, yeah, ratatouille. pizza? It tastes like the meals of ratatouille. Oh. I don't know if I want to taste ratatouille. Is there, is there a rat in it? No, I'm just kidding. But there's cheese. <laughs> <laughs> so let me taste it with the big old, I'm just going to do it, you know? Just do it. Plenty in room. Yeah. Oh, uh oh, a little bitter there. A little too much savory. Strong cheese. <laughs> I would just dice that cheese and spread it around your pizza. Maybe that's what I should have done. Oh, I'll try that for my bite. Yeah. All right, my turn. All right. All right. <laughs> so, so now I'm going to try... try it. Maybe fold it. Oh, I'll fold like it. That taco. way I get a bite yeah. with the cheese and everything. So I think it's meant to be like mixed together. Shove that cheese in there. 
What there do you go. think? <laughs> hmm? It's a taco now. <laughs> All of it? I'm gonna try. Here we go. It's sure. gonna be messy. Here we go. Oh my god. Really good. So my initial taste is like I'm eating spaghetti on a pizza. It has a real spaghetti kind of flavor to it. Um, and you get that bitterness of the cheese that kind of, so the sauce is kind of sweet. It's kind of a sweeter sauce, um, but the cheese kind of dulls down the, the sweetness to it. I don't taste much of that. Was there a zucchini or something in it? I don't know what it was, like a zucchini uh, cooked something. I don't taste that. It's mostly the cheese. The cheese is very strong. It's strong right. and the pasta. Yeah. Yeah. Really good though. I like it. I'd get it again. Yeah, me mm -hmm. too. That was delicious. Definitely. That was very delicious. Okay, well, since you I'm want, on yeah. the camera here, I'm going to wash that down with the... Um, Which one do you want to try? With the little critique cognac sidecar. Ooh. I wonder if it's like the one from Carthay, because Carthay has a sidecar, and I oh. love their sidecar. So I'm wondering, I'm going to give it a taste without, but I think I'm going to need to stir it, because I think it's all settled. On the bottom. Yeah, it needs to be stirred. Stir it. They get like all the club soda taste on top. Yes. You know? And I don't know if this was like a pre-mixed drink already or is this something they're actually mixing in the uh, behind there? I think it might be like a pre-mix. Like a pre-mix and yeah. they add the, the stuff after? Yeah, let's see. Yeah, much better. Much better? Definitely. Ooh. Um, so it definitely has a lot of the flavor of um, strawberries, and I want to say. It doesn't say it has strawberry in it, but it has a very strawberry flavor. Slight taste of, slight hint of alcohol. It did have a strawberry on top. It did. I kind of pushed it down. Yeah. So it's good though. Um, what did I get it again? I'd save the $17 and I'd go to Carthay and get a real sidecar. Ooh, <laughs> mic dropped. Now I'm going to try the sidecar and see. I like it. It's good. It's good. It's fruity, right? It's fruity. It's fruity. It's a fruity sidecar. Yeah. I think it's good. Yeah. But I think, yeah. there's other better drinks, of yeah. course. It was $17. $17 is... So. Yeah, it's true. All right. But it was still good. Okay, well, let's... All right, I'm gonna rip it. Rip it good. Rip it good. Rip it good. Na, 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 na. Okay, ready? Let's see. Here we go. There's a money shot. Ugh. Oh, can you? Oh, oh I got nice. half and half. Well, that's pretty beefy in there, huh? It's pretty beefy. Ooh, I like the smells. That's a pork, right? Yes. Let's give it a taste. I think I'm gonna like this. So should I taste it without? Try without the sauce. Okay, I'm gonna try it without the sauce. This is the, uh, again guys, this is the uh, Red Panda Bao. It's good. It's good. That's stuffing right there. Is it? I think it's stuffing. Really? Like Thanksgiving stuffing? Thanksgiving stuffing. Hey, interesting. It's good though. It's good. I, I love stuffing, so. It's good. Now I'm gonna taste it. I'm kind of scared. Sauce? I'm scared of this sauce. I don't know I think why. It's chili. It's like some kind of chili paste sauce. Oh god! Look at how red it is. Orange. Oh. Okay. Here it's we go. Pika. Here we go. It wasn't too bad. Now I'm gonna. There is some oh, chili on the bottom. It's going to town Ooh. on it. It's kind of, you kind of oh, have to mix that. Yeah, there's like little chili flakes inside of there, it looks like. It needs to be kind of stirred around a bit. Oh, so. no. I don't know about this. Do it. Do it. I don't Do know about it. this. Okay. <laughs> We're going to have to. Okay. A we have to dog, do a fair. Dare, yeah. We have to do a fair. A fair okay. assessment of this. Dip it. Dip it good. Okay. It's 
services. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh-oh. I need... Ooh, it's one of those sneakers. <laughs> good stuff? It's good. Kind of makes you want to have more. But it is very spicy. It catches you. So at first you're like... Well, it's not too bad, and as you're chewing and chewing, it gets stronger and stronger. It's one of those Eey, sneaks sneakers. up on you. Ah, all right, you got me excited. I gotta try okay. it. Definitely have to try it. Definitely have to do it. I'm just gonna just tap it. So you can dial in your spice level mm -hmm. pretty much. Give it a dab. It's fine. A dab? Because it gives it that perfect... How do we give it a dab? Dab it. Oh, dab it. <laughs> <laughs> Just give it a dab it. <laughs> okay. My turn right. it, guys. I'm going to pour it in. Oh, no. Don't do that. Oh, okay. Just a little bit. Pour okay. it in. What do you guys think? All right. I'm telling you. Okay. I, I don't my... know. You might tolerate it better. I got my drink How's ready. How's that nearby? Oh, shit. <laughs> That's hot. Oh, my God. You weren't kidding. I need a napkin. Hold on. Okay. I warned you. So it's really good. The, spot, the sauce is very spicy. Uh -huh. I mean, it's very spicy. Um, the flavors I'm getting, yeah, I guess like a stuffing kind of Thanksgiving stuffing mm -hmm. flavor. Mm -hmm. We can definitely taste the, um, we can definitely taste the pork in there. Yeah. You know, um, I'm honestly, I'm old, I'm just tasting the spice right now. <laughs> it's just overwhelming the spice, but the pork has good flavor in it. Um, it looks like inside of it, you have, um, you got pork, you have some celery, some green onion cut up in there. And it's all in a, wrapped in a bao bun. I'm going again. I got addicted to that spice. Oh my God, you... I got a lot of drink to wash it down. Okay. Right. Mm, mm -hmm. Do it with the spice. That's really good, for sure. <laughs> yeah. Moving on now. <laughs> That's good. Okay. So now we're going to do the um, cheating. This comes from the Elemental Table. This is the Smoke Fire Wood Barbecue Spice Impossible Chicken. So, I don't know. I mean, look at the, uh, this is definitely uh, charred pretty well. This is a green charred onion. green onion. It looks like it's got like some kind of like, I don't know if that's Nopales? chopped onions or. Oh, is it jalapeno? Oh, let me taste it. Ooh. No, oh, pickle. pickle. Pickle? Oh, okay chopped pickles, and then it looks like it's got some kind of drizzle. Yeah, barbecue sauce. It's a barbecue sauce. Oh. Let's try it. Try it's a fancy it way together. to do a chicken tender. Mmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. The chicken is just like the one you buy at the store. You know, in the frozen aisle, <laughs> like a Vandy camps or something. I don't know. And it's impossible. Oh, it's a possible chicken. Yes. Okay. That right, explains it. Um, but it's really good, actually. The mixture combined with the um, green onion and the pickle, along with the barbecue sauce on top. Yeah, it, it's a good flavor. It's a good taste. Is it something I would get again? I probably wouldn't. No. no it's not my cup of tea. <laughs> But um, give it a try. Okay. All right. Whoop. Oopsies. <laughs> okay. So now I'm going to go ahead and try it. I'm going to put some of this stuff here. Spread it out. Get one of these green onion guys. Like that. Oh, I should put some on that one. Okay. Here we go. 
Oh, I'm going to bring this closer. <laughs> we'll get some more napkins. Mm. That's, that's really good. What do you think of the, the combination of flavors there? I think it goes well with the combination of flavors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The onion, the barbecue sauce, um, the little pickles. I mean, all of it goes. I think it's good. I mean, it does taste like chicken. That's what's weird about it. Huh. But it is good. Okay. okay, so we're trying the H2O, H2O Rita. This was this was something that we got from Elemental Table. Oh, looks like it had a candy. Look oh at yeah, that. That a candy. Sugar candy, huh? Sugar candy. So I'm gonna give it a little stir. And let's go ahead and give it a try. Let's see. Mm, that's actually pretty good. That's what, really good. What's it taste um, like? That kind of like a... Pineapple flavor. Getting um, pineapple. I want it to say peach. Like a peach flavor. Yeah. It's got blue curacao. You can see blue the blue. Blue curacao, for sure. Yeah. Um, all in all, I like this. This is good. Yeah. I like tropical fruity drinks. So this this is up my alley for huh? sure. Cool. We got the wind blowing. Okay. All right. <laughs> so this one is the Koi Nut Whoopie Cookie Pie. So looks like uh, it's got some frosting inside. Oh yeah. And the the bread is very. Ooh, it looks mad. Very, it looks angry. Stainy. It looks a little angry. Doesn't it look like the little the angry dog cart over yes. there? Yes. Pixar Pier? Kind of has yes. like that look Elementary, to it. Like a fire. A fire. Elements, right? Oh. Elemental. Isn't this called like the elemental? This is elemental table. Oh, yeah. Okay. So this one is koi, koi nut whoopie cookie pie. Ah. So let's, nice. it's like kind of lava-ish looking. So let's. Let's take a look. Make sure I don't get on my shirt. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Okay. Here we go. Wow. Oh my! Let me, oh, look at how red that is. It's on fire. This girl is on fire. It does have like a lemony flavor? I want to say. Um, I think it's red velvet cake. Oh. On the cookie pie part. Okay. Um, but I am getting, I want to say a little bit of a coconut, maybe. You got coconut on the mind. <laughs> yeah, but it's coconut. Um, it's overall, it's pretty good. All right. Now John's going to go ahead and try this, uh, coin nut, um, cookie pie. <laughs> Whoopie cookie pie. First, I'm going to give this thing a real quick whirl. The H2O Rita. Oh, yes. Yeah. Definitely. Um, I can taste the, I can taste the uh, tequila in there. Because it is a margarita. I assume it has tequila. Um, it's sweet. It comes with this little sugar stick. So it really adds a lot of sweetness to it. Um, but yeah, it's got definitely a pineapple flavor. Um, the blue curacao, like that orange flavor going, very citrusy. Um, yeah, I, I don't know if it's pineapple, if it's coconut, or if it's just the pineapple that gives that sense of coconut. Yeah. Uh, but it's really good. I actually like it. I, I probably would like to take this out now because I think it's getting a little on the sweet side. So I'm going to take that out. It, just, it already has enough sugar in it for me. Yeah, it's really good. Very, very quenching. I don't taste the alcohol though. A little bit of tequila, but not that much. No. <laughs> All right. So the next one I'm going to do is the is that koi nut whooping cookie pie from Elemental Table? Yeah, the koi nut whoopie cookie pie. 
Did I say whoopee cushion? Whoopee cushion pie. Whoopee no, cushion pie? <laughs> whoopee cookie okay. pie. Let's see what it tastes like. Mm. It's very orangey, citrusy. A lot of orange flavor to me in it. Is that what I'm tasting? Mm -hmm. I thought I couldn't figure out like the, the flavors. Yeah, like an orange flavor, um, citrus flavor. Um, the red, the cake, tastes like um, red velvet. Mm -hmm. And we have the Spider-Man show going on now, so I might get a little loud here, guys. Uh -oh. But um, it's really good. It's too sweet for me, though. I wouldn't get it again. It's, it's too, too much. Yeah. It's too I, much sugar. I'd say the same. So um, I will pass on this one. Yes. <laughs> So what was your favorite thing that we tried from the, the carts? You know, I really like the bell bun and I, the pizza, what? the little pizza thing. The Yeah, I think the pizza was one of the ratatouille pizza. The ratatouille pizzetta, 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 pizzetta. Emphasis. It was pretty good. Um, the thing I least liked was, um, uh, I think the, the, um, the, the, the whoopie pie. pie thing, right? Yeah, but you know, I think for me, it's because I'm not into like, it was too sweet for me. Yeah, I think that's what it was. It was just too much, too much sugar for me. Yeah. Too, and stuff. The thing that shocked me the most was that fire roasted barbecue chicken impossible oh, tender yeah. thing. The wow. Chicken tender. Yeah. The wood. Yeah. That one's, that one's pretty good. Yeah. Who knew that that would go together so well, that combination of different ingredients and stuff. So. What a way to spice up impossible chicken. <laughs> yes, yes. And it's it's weird, but it doesn't, I don't know, it doesn't, it tastes like chicken. Yeah, yeah. You know what it tastes like? It is weird. Those Tyson chicken tenders. That's what the, That's what I was trying to remember, the Tyson chicken tenders. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're gonna- It kind of tastes like that. <laughs> we're gonna head over to Hollywood land now and see uh, what other kind of grub we can whip up. <laughs> We have some sourcing of here today. Let us continue. Come, <laughs> Oh, I see you all want to wiggle your hips. <laughs> Okay, so we have a very tiny, 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 small chicken salad. <laughs> Talk about very, it. It's very, small. very small. Very small. It's like the size I'm of your talking head. The, the size of my, smaller than my head here. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> so we got the humongous taco salad. So very small. I don't know if it's going to be enough. <laughs> Anywho, should we, let's go ahead and give it a try. Let's see, should I? Let's go for it. Yeah. I don't know how you're going to do it. How do you see. eat this thing? I okay. I don't know if it's like a taco or if it's just like a salad. Let's, uh, let's see. Oh, we also got the... Uh, oh, yeah. We also got the cookie. Cookies and cream culver? Wait. Cookies and cream culver. It's not Cookies coming in the focus, so that's okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and give it a try. I'm like perplexed about how to do this. Okay. I would just break it and then just eat it. I'm like going to try it. it. Oh, okay. Once. Okay, here we go. Okay, ready? I don't think it's meant to be that way. <laughs> I love taco salads, and this right here, my friends, is a really, you need to get this type. If you like salt salads, you like taco salads, this is delicious. By all means, the chicken has a lot of flavor. There's uh, romaine lettuce, um, marinated chicken, cotija cheese, avocado, corn, pico de gallo. It's and some. It looks like avocado ranch. 
I want to say avocado ranch or maybe cilantro cilantro uh, Caesar like a dressing, crema. Like, a, like a crema. Yeah. But all in all, this is really good. This is really good. Nice. Really good. And of course, it comes with a tortilla shell, so you can you know scoop up and eat. <laughs> but this is excellent. This is cool. This is one of my I think favorites right now. I'm gonna try it now. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna do just the. Uh, I'm gonna break it. That that's just too messy oh, for me. Oh, okay. <laughs> just cheating. No, just kidding. <laughs> what I am gonna do is I'll pour some of this in here. Oh, there you go. Tostada style. And then taste it like a tostada, huh? Oh yeah, there you go. Get some lettuce in it. Okay. There we go. Tastes like the um, I don't like the taco salad you get from a pollo loco. No. What? <laughs> like the taco salad you get from a pollo loco. Really? <laughs> really? You know what though. it kind of reminded me of? El Torito salad, the taco salad. I think that's what it is, like the mm -hmm. El Torito taco salad. Um, let me see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's good, huh? It's got that marinade, like a um, like a red salsa marinade in it. Mm -hmm. um, you can taste the, that marinade, and then just the crunch of the, the taco, almost like a like wonton kind of. Yeah. Style, you know, but really good. It's pretty good. I see why everybody's getting them in there. There's like a line of taco salads. Yes. Very good. Definitely get those. Yeah. Okay. So we also got the um, cookies and cream, cold brew. And it comes with an Oreo cookie. Um, I'm going to try it without mixing it and see what it tastes like. <laughs> Ooh, that's really good. It tastes like a cookies and cream shake. Oh. Um, I'm gonna stir it. Yeah. Stir it up. Stir it up. Fine. Oh boy, that looks all sorts of yummy. Yeah. Stir it up now. Try to mix in all the flavors. You got like some Ooh, chocolate there is syrup chocolate in, there. in there. See that? Yeah. Yeah, so you want to mix in those flavors. They're really good. <laughs> my my mustache. Mustache. Uh, but definitely, you can taste the chocolate. There's like a like a chocolate shake taste to it, but then there's also that you get that coffee, that bitter coffee flavor in there too. Ooh. It's really good. I can see why it's pretty popular. Yeah. Very good one. Definitely. Um, this one compared to the Docking Brew, Docking Bay 7 uh, Cold Brew. What's it called again? I forgot what it's called. Um, I forgot what it's called. But um, I think I like this one better. Although that other one's a good go-to. If you're in Disneyland, that's the one. If you're in DCA, you got this one. Yes. <laughs> Here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and try this cookies and cream cold brew. So let's see what it tastes like and see what it's all about. Mm. Ooh, that's that's very chocolatey. You get that coffee taste after, but I'm tasting a lot of the chocolate. Mm. This is actually really good. Yeah. Very good. What do you think? It's on the sweet side. It is. Very chocolatey, huh? Very chocolatey. What do you think uh, compared to the one at Docking Bay? I kind of like the one in the dock, at Docking Bay 7. Yeah. I think a little slightly better. It's not as sweet, huh? It's not as sweet, but I like Cocoa Puffs, so. Yeah. I could, that's true. Yeah, that reminds me a lot of Cocoa Puffs, so it's nice to get some in your mouth and then while you're drinking, you're drinking. Yeah, because you like to eat ice in the cup. Yeah. You know, that's kind of that same. Yeah. Same thing. The same thing, yeah. But it's, it's very good. Mm. So what did you think about that taco salad? Oh, man. 
That was so good. Um, I really love, um, I like taco salads in general. Yeah. Especially El Torito's. I like El Torito's. But this was delicious. I think so too. It had like, it had marinated chicken, romaine lettuce, lettuce, pico de gallo. Uh, it had corn. corn in it. Yeah. Yeah. And cotija cheese. It was so good. So good. And the marinade on the, the chicken was really good too. Yes. It gave it a lot of good flavor. Very tasty, not dry. No, more tomatoey too, not like spice marinade. No, more of a tomatoey kind of thing going with avocado. it. Avocado. It had avocado too. Sorry. Oh, an avocado. Yeah. <laughs> it had avocado. It just, the mix together was good. Yeah. <laughs> And this really is good. good, but man, it's sweet. sweet. It's got a lot of sugar in it. Uh, so, if you like sugar, this is a good one. <laughs> you like sweet stuff, you'll like this. That's the one right there. <laughs> I mean, get. I love it. I just wish it was more coffee. Tasty. Yeah, I want more of that. It's more chocolatey tasty. Yeah. And I think I would want more of a coffee taste to it. More of a cold brew, you know, espresso. That's what I want in it. Yeah. All right, let's go check out Hollywood Land. Hollywood Land. See what it's all about. Let's see. It's so cool. You can sit in your uh, favorite old car and watch uh, some Toy Story. Yeah. That's what they're showing, right? Toy Story. Mm-hmm. Yeah. At the short stop driving theater. Yeah. Oh, it's a short from Toy Story, isn't it? Yes. That's pretty neat. It's pretty cool. Another booth over here. Hangar management. Joyful yellow, comforting mac and cheese. So it looks like they have these booths set up everywhere for the uh, Pixar Fest, these dining booths. They did the photograph. Let's see. There you go. Thanks for taking a pause in your day. You made him sing. <laughs> made him sing. <laughs> so it is. I know, that's pretty cool. <laughs> okay, guys, so that was our uh, day to day over here at uh, DCA. Uh, yeah. Trying out all the cool, uh, fun little Pixar. The booths. Booths. The booths from the booths. Um, we, we didn't plan it. Like we didn't know what they would have. No so idea. we came in just, uh, looking at everything that each booth has to offer and yeah. decide from there. We got a little menu right oh, here. Yeah. yeah. They have menus scattered <laughs> Make throughout. Make sure you, you get one of these. Um, sorry, holding it upside down. Get one of these cause it'll give you, a, um, all the items that they're offering and it'll it also gives you a map of where it's located yeah where to find them um but and there's a qr code on it so yeah you can just look at it on your phone too. and if you want to check it out you can scan that right now so there you, you go. can go ahead and take a look and decide what you're gonna have or yeah. do what we do we did just come and by, you know, by just, the seat of our pants, we were choosing. Yes, you can do the same. <laughs> and the cool thing is, is that they let you purchase all of your your items in items one. in one spot. You're not having to go line, you know, place to place, standing in the line because the lines they're getting pretty long uh, when we were leaving. So I can only imagine. And I can give you a little secret. Go to the elemental table. I think it's the the one with the impossible um, yeah. chicken and the. Um, yeah, they have something else. Go there because I don't know. From my experience, I saw less of a line there. Yeah, I think the, I think too because um, I don't know if it's just because it's just starting or what. Yeah. But um, maybe because of that, uh, there wasn't a lot of people there. But you kind of just walked right up. Didn't yeah, because we went to the one. Um, I think it was the panda, the red panda one, and that one had a line, a long yeah. line. And I walked two booths because they're kind of close yeah. um, over by the waterfalls. Um, and it was no line. Yeah. So there you go. <laughs> and I ordered everything we were going to have. So, so tip is find the shortest line. 
stand in it, order everything from it, and then you just go and get your food. Even if the point. item isn't from that particular booth. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but um, so, anyways, thanks again, you guys, for uh, joining us today yeah, here at uh, Disney. Thanks, thanks for, for hanging out with us. Thanks for hanging out with us. And you guys. feliz dia de los madres. Happy Mother's Day Happy Mother's today Day. and Sunday. <laughs> Bye. And all weekend, you know, because we just got to celebrate some weeks. Yeah. All weekend. Yeah. Well, really, all year. Right? All year. Moms do a lot. For it. So. <laughs> all right. Uh, we'll see you guys later. <laughs> we'll see you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Guess what? It's grad night tonight. What does that mean? The children, children of the, the buses, buses are, are here. Coming. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and more <laughs> are coming. <laughs> Shout out to Average Dad for that one. Yes. <laughs>